What's happening, football fans? I've got something special for you today. We're going to let you know what's propping with three NFL divisional playoff round player props. I'm Allie Burns from Picks and Parlays, and we're now sponsored by Caesar Sportsbook. Guys, check out the link that's in the description of this video. Click on that link, get yourself signed up with Caesars, and they'll match your very first bet, win, lose, or draw up to $1,001. And if you're located in the state of New York, guess what? Bonus prize from Caesars. They're going to drop 300 bucks into your account just for signing up. No deposit necessary. And then when you do deposit, they'll match that money up to three grand. So you guys don't want to miss, miss out on this super hot deal. Now with me today, I've got NFL expert handicapper Nick Earl from Earl Sports Bets here to lay three player props on us. How's it going, Nick? Hey, what's propping? Yeah, we're going to... Limited amount of games this week, so we're going to dig a little bit into the player prop market for this week. That's the way to do it, man. Um, I've got a lot of the morning woodies that are cashing big on player props. Uh, I know a lot of the handicappers on our side are into them as well. So what's this first one we're going to talk about today? Yeah, the first one I'm going to go with here, I'm going to have two from uh, the same game from the same team, and then I have another one from another one. So uh, looking at the first one here, we have the Los Angeles Rams. They're going to be at the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. And I'm going to be looking at Matthew Stafford to kick it off here. Uh, over half an interception. And here's my idea behind this game. Uh, I haven't done really player props or anything like that since my DraftKings days. I used to do that. So kind of had to put that hat back on and try to break down some of these player props. And my, my theory behind this game, my intentions for this game is the Tampa Bay Buccaneers have one of the best rush defenses in the NFL, which means they're going to slow down the running game of the LA Rams, which is going to force Matthew Stafford to throw the ball. Now, last week, I think he had only 15 or 16 pass attempts, which led him to not throw an interception for the first time in like a month or something along those lines for games. Uh, so I, I expect uh, Matthew Stafford to have to throw the ball a few more times in this game against the Buccaneers to really be able to move the ball because I don't really see them being able to run the ball too much against this Tampa Bay Buccaneers rush defense, which also leads me to my second play here. I like the Buccaneers in this game, but one thing the Buccaneers do struggle in is covering tight ends, and uh, that's leading me to Tyler Higby here uh, for the L.A. Rams over 42.5 receiving yards. I expect Matthew Stafford to have to throw the ball more. Uh, which means they're going to have to uh, hit up a target here and uh, one of his more reliable targets of Tyler Higby. Um, and I think he gets at least 43 receiving yards. My final one will be taking place between the Buffalo Bills and the Kansas City Chiefs. And this one is a, it's one that's a nice little plus money one here. I like Dawson Knox to get an anytime touchdown against, uh, against the Kansas City Chiefs in this game. Uh, Dawson Knox is a reliable red zone target here for Josh Allen in the Buffalo Bills. He had two touchdowns last week against the New England Patriots, and I think he might be able to get one in this game as well. That's a very high total of 55, 55 and a half between the Kansas City Chiefs and the uh, Buffalo Bills. So I expect points in that, this game, and I expect Dawson Knox to get a touchdown there. And you get a nice little price of plus 200 here. So for my props, I'm going with over half an interception for Matthew Stafford. I'm looking at Tyler Higby of the LA Rams over 42 and a half receiving yards. And I like a Dawson Knox anytime touchdown for the Buffalo Bills. All right. So that's what's propping. Excellent analysis there, Nick. Nice breakdowns. Um, I know our friend Detroit Lenny has been all over the Matthew Stafford over 0.5 interceptions like all season long. He cashes on that puppy all the time. So I love that one. Love that one. Um, let our viewers know, Nick, what does Earl Sports Bets have lined up over at picksandparlays.net in the way of premium plays and packages for the rest of the weekend? Yeah, we have. Uh, we're probably going to have a play on a couple of these uh, NFL games. And then, of course, we have college basketball, NHL, NBA, all the good stuff there. So uh, got a lot of uh, plays that we go come out with, uh, got a lot of volume. So we'll always have plenty over at the site. All right. Beautiful. And viewers at home, when you're over at the site, picksandparlays.net, don't forget to use the promo code YEAR. Y-E-A-R is going to save you 20% off all of the Earl Sports Bets best bets. Um, that includes like a one day pass week long, month long, year long subscription. So definitely get your hook yourself hooked up and use that promo code. And until then we're rolling with Nick Earl's three player props for this NFL divisional round.